Hello Blockheads, this is Bob Anglin for Blockspace and I'm here today unboxing a brand new Siren Labs Finny blockchain smartphone. So what does that mean? I'm not absolutely sure. I've read some reviews, I've heard some people's opinions, but now it's my turn to do it myself. So keep watching. So here I am with my trusty little sharp knife, my sharp little utensil. I cut this baby open here. Uh, chubby chubby. One little cut there. And one down the side here. Like I said, I haven't unboxed this thing at all. I haven't even taken it out of the package. This is exactly how it arrived. Of course, we have things to play with later. More things to play with later. So I was told that this uh, Siren smartphone, when I first was talk told about it, I was told that Siren Labs makes basically the Ferrari of smartphones. So most of these, Siren Labs phones run around $15,000. This one is at a nice price point of $1,000. So I'm going to check it out a little bit. We'll get into the specs later on. Has a bunch of stuff here on the back. I'm not sure what that's all about. But let's get rid of this stuff. Let's get rid of this box. And let's go to work on what's inside of this thing here. So we just take out all this. Something more unboxing, more unwrapping. So, like I said, I have watched some reviews. I have read several reviews. But from what I can tell, most of the reviews I've watched are people that are smartphone gurus. People who, you know, they check out smartphones. Um, some of them have absolutely no idea, obviously no idea about what the blockchain is, what cryptocurrency is, or anything else. What makes this thing so special is that it has a cold wallet built in. So, although it's now not the only one out there, it's definitely the first one out there. So, welcome to the blockchain era. It's very fancy. Look at that. Welcome to the blockchain era. There's the phone right there on top. Just like that. I wonder what all this stuff is. What's in here? We'll look at what else is in here. So in the box we get this wonderful introduction. And then in here we have, what do we have? Uh, it takes a smarter person than me to open this box any further, I think. There we go. Oh, this is like all of the documentation in a nice little pouch. Fancy. We have here is the charger, it looks like. Sometimes, um, you know, I'm not a things guy. I'm not a person who uh, really cares a lot about things. I say have less, do more. But, um... For some people, this might be really awesome. Um, let's see what's going on here. How in the world did they get that? So this is just the charger. Here's your charger. Very fancy, right? All the stuff you get that comes in the box. Then here is what? What is this? Um, oh. I think these are different adapters for wherever you may might travel for your different chargers. That's what I think this is. So wherever you live in the world, you've got your different outlet socket thing there. Um, and I think that's pretty much the end of our... Let's see if there's any more goodies in here. Also, is um, has a dongle for headphones, and what else? Nope, that's pretty much it. 
So you got this fantastic box. You got all this documentation in a nice little pouch. All of these different things. But I'm going to put all that stuff aside for now as I look at the actual phone itself because that's what we're actually here to look at. So I start here. See, it says start here. So what do we have here? What is this thing? So they talk about this thing being the Ferrari of smartphones and it does have a little sports car -y shape to it. A lot of people have been commenting on that. They think that looks great and all that stuff. To me, it's like, how does it work? What does it work? How, how is it going to work? Um, so let's get into it a little bit. I'm probably going to have to read some instructions here. So I don't actually want to do a review, but let's get to looking at just a few things about the phone itself. Here it is, this Siren Labs Finney blockchain cell phone. It comes in white, gray, and black, and this one, as you can see, is black. It has an aluminum alloy body. It, it has a five and a half inch um, IPS LCD quadrilateral HD screen, and the glass tapers off from the, on the top and on the bottom, which is actually a pretty cool feature. The camera, of course, has the obligatory 13 megapixel selfie camera. And on the back, it has a 12 megapixel autofocusing rear facing camera with the LED flash. Right here underneath the camera is actually the fingerprint sensor. And I have a few thoughts about this initially, but I actually want to uh, mess with this a little bit more and I'll save that for when I actually do a real, real review. So here's the SIM card slot right here and in the box you saw the little SIM card, card tool. I didn't get into that much, but we'll play with that later on. We also have dual speakers on each side. You have the little mic, which is this little hole. Oh uh, wait, where am I at? Okay, yeah, little hole right here on the bottom. So it's a pretty hefty, good looking phone with the standard features. But this right here is what this is all about. This is what makes the Finney blockchain cell phone a blockchain cell phone. Right here at the top of it is the cold storage crypto wallet. Now cold storage means that it's not connected to the internet. So it can't be hacked. So it pops up right here and you're ready to go, crypto. So the wallet has distributed ledger consensus, uh, intrusion prevention, and it supports both uh, cryptocurrencies and tokens. A lot of people have said that this is kind of flimsy, but I don't see it right now. I guess if I mess with it a lot, it would. Um, but we'll play around with it a little bit more and I'll tell you more about it later. So the guts of this phone begins with an octa-core CPU, a Qualcomm, Snapdragon 845 64 bit processor and a Qualcomm Adreno 630 GPU. It runs a, um, Android 8.1, which is actually Siren OS. It has 6 gigabytes of RAM and supports up to 256 gigabytes of external memory. It also includes a secure peer to peer resource sharing system, blockchain tampering proof um, physical security switch which I actually need to figure out. I'm gonna have to get into this a little bit more to figure that part out. It has three-factor authentication, LTE uh, category 18, Bluetooth, dual band Wi-Fi, NFC, I, the IP52 splash resistance. So that's pretty much all of it, but in the meantime, I'm gonna to have to fire this baby up so I can actually really look at it and find out what it does. And um, I just want you guys to go ahead and subscribe. Make sure that if you have any questions, you go ahead and put those in there. If you want to see me do something with this phone, that's fine as long as it's not illegal or immoral. And I'll give it a try. So you go ahead and do that. Let's look over one more time what we got in the box and then we'll finish this thing up. So here is what we have. So we have in the box, we have the phone in this wonderful welcome case. You get your SIM card tool there. You have your documents, which is you know your startup documents, uh, quick start, safety instructions, things like that. You have your power and data transfer cord and your audio adapter. You also have your universal power plug-in with several power 
plugins for you know wherever you might be traveling, which is awesome because we're planning a trip around the world using only crypto, and that would be awesome. So that is the unboxing of the Siren Labs Finny blockchain smartphone. In my next video, I'm going to be firing up that cold storage wallet, and we're going to see what this phone can do. So. Make sure you subscribe, hit that notification button, and follow us at Blockspace and me at Bob Anglin on Twitter. And help us as we continue to shamelessly promote blockchain technology. Bye. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind.